that. I'll have that. Okay. Pass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's been good, yeah. We've had really good weather. Uh, I suppose we can't really complain. It's been a bit too hot, I know it's a bad complaint to have. But um, overall, it's been very good. And um, the kids are enjoying it, so the main thing is not raining. and. All the kids are happy out. All good, enjoying our week. Lovely weather for it, so. It's been a beautiful week. Great weather. Good, good. What age groups have you got? I have the six year olds all week and. I had the ten year olds, but I'm filling in for Ben here now with six year olds. Is he stacking? No! Uh, I wouldn't say that now, no. I'd say he's a top coach. Top, top coach. I need to go. Just uh, uh, the match the other night on um, didn't win, but it didn't matter. He spent promotion to Division One, first time in 20 years, and you played very well throughout the league. Was yeah, very happy. Yeah, delighted to get to Division One. Yeah, first time in 25 years. So um, yeah, delighted to get over the line. Very good. And then you have been on development squads over the last few years. Are you currently on a squad? No, I'm not. Not this year. Now I'm just playing with the club. Again, hopefully get into the first team soon. I'm you know, playing B football and working my way up. And have a minor final from last year that's being played in Saturday week. So looking forward to that. Ben. Getting loads of games in, so I can't complain. Good, good. Yeah, and I it. suppose seeing it's now get to Division oh, 1. Oh, yeah. Chances ahead, it must spur on a lad. Definitely, to definitely. Better. So encouraging. Like, the future's oh. right now. We're, we're on the rise. Like, so that's, Why you have that's a, the main thing. It's good. Why you have a Fred. Uh, we have 16 coaches all together. So we've all spread across 11 pods. So just with COVID that we have more split up um, nice and evenly so it's good to have as much course as we can then to cover all the groups. <laughs> Very good yeah, the lads are moving well to be fair them so we can last no more. Yeah it's been good you know the, the, the kids are great so they're easy to handle. They'd be looking for games to go in and then maybe five minutes later it's too hot or warm so you have to keep them on their toes and get them enjoying games so uh, yeah, we kind of planned the night before, get some games ready and have loads of games ready so they're not bored for the whole day. <laughs> no, really hot this week, but really good. We were working with six-year-olds, so it was great to get them in, get them moving and getting a bit of ball work started with them. Uh, I played Mogu and Ace Law, and then I played football here in East Sands Law. I know you uh. are. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Playing the ball here, so it's grand. Got, got the home club to do cool camps, so it's grand, yeah. Uh, I got a few, yeah. I'm in Kilcullen next week then. Um, I was in Confi last week. I think I have three or four no more weeks of them, yeah. And I'm in Nate for the next two weeks. Woohoo! It's too bad now. We've tried to get them into the shade every now and again, get lots of water, some cream on board, and lots of breaks. So they're happy out now. Good. Keen, you have a minor final post goal from last year, just yeah. COVID coming up Saturday week, is it? Uh, yeah, Saturday week again, Suncroft. Well, how are you feeling about that? Uh, yeah, looking forward to it, and hopefully like after being postponed for a year, it'd be good to win it. Good. So this is the fourth week of cool camps now at the minute, so we've another four to go. Um, I have three weeks cool camps in Nace, and then one left in Sarsfield to finish off the summer. 